Hi y'all, this is Max from ZetoMax.com. Let me do a quick uh, build review of the Asus UL30VT laptop I have here that I got today. Um, the build is pretty good. Uh, it's very thin as you can see. Um, it's got two USB ports here. It's got an Ethernet jack, the power. Um, it's got Bluetooth. It's got the earphone, a microphone, SD card slot. Uh, it's got an HDMI, which is really cool for hooking up to your uh, HD TV or HD LCD. Another USB and a VGA, which I really don't need. Nobody uses VGA anymore, um, unless for emergencies. And it doesn't have a CD-ROM, which I love because I hate, you know, adding bulkiness to a laptop just because it has a CD-ROM. I can always use an external one. And. Uh, Here's the uh, laptop, and the fan runs pretty cool if you put it on battery saving mode. It gets a little bit hot, but not too bad, and the processor was designed for a uh, low voltage, meaning it's going to run cooler than, you know, a regular Intel du uh, Core Duo 2 processor. And here's my uh, EEPC netbook, 10.1 10, 10 inch, uh, 1000 HE, HE, which I take everywhere. I love this thing. And one of the reasons why I got this one was because of this laptop and uh, how long the battery lasts on this. And this one's rated at 9 hours. And this one, the new one is rated at 12 hours. So I'm thinking this will actually last uh, longer than uh, this one, which has also an uh, Atom N280 processor for ultra low voltage and long computing but uh, the, 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 um, the selling point of this Asus laptop is that the price is only $799 plus the performance uh, testing done by uh, PC World uh, they did a PC, uh, test on the Asus UL80VT-A1 which is pretty much the same hardware but it's 14 inches and based on that test, this laptop and that laptop has the same performance specs, almost the same as an Apple MacBook Pro uh, with the Intel Core 2 Duo P7550, uh, 7550 or the 2.26 GHz processor MacBook. And it also beats the uh, HP Pavilion uh, with uh, Intel Core 2 Duo T6600 and also it beats the Acer Aspire uh, with uh, SU4100 obviously because that's an older processor anyway this laptop has uh, pretty good marks one of the uh, the best parts about this laptop is that it comes with a NVIDIA graphics card and also you, it's switchable between the integrated graphic card unlike the UL30A which you can't which I almost was gonna buy and that one's 50 bucks cheaper but for 50 bucks more you get the graphics card and also what was one other thing also you get the uh, you can also expand the memory up to 8 gigabytes which is cool so that was the review of the build and based on you know hand testing they weigh about the same I think this one actually uh, weighs less and my netbook is pretty light and if it's as uh, light as my netbook and more powerful and a bigger or a bigger display you know it's gonna go with me everywhere I, I love this laptop I highly recommend it and uh, uh, disclosure I don't get paid by Amazon or Asus I just do these because I study them and uh, it's kind of fun to study laptops and netbooks. Anyway, get one. These are, are the best laptops ever. I give them my 13.3 inch laptop of the year award. Thumbs up, baby.